All right, so we're doing a Tracks News special edition here with my friend Kush Poppy. We're going to talk a little bit about Putin, again, putting the world in perspective uh, uh, for everybody. Do you know this gentleman right here? Yes. Okay, I'm going to show you a, a secret palace that he built. He just got caught. There was a nice, interesting thing. So this gentleman, this individual right here, his name is Navalny. Putin tried to poison him with nerve gas. He survived. Now, he just came back in Russia. He got arrested. And while he was arrested, he released this monster video. This video right now is up to, let's see how many views. As soon as my, what do you call it? 74 million views since January 19th. Wow. This is serious, serious stuff. Wow. And he's basically showcasing Putin's ridiculous palace. And I want to take you on a tour of this thing and you tell me what you think. Is it on an island? It's, it's in the Black Sea, and uh, it starts off something like this. This is what he built, but you're going to uh, go for the ride and stuff. So he's, uh, Putin's renovating the palace, but let me t t uh, show you the, down the whole thing. Take you for the tour. So then he has uh, the helicopter pad over here, the you know, different uh, trees and groves as you go through the palace. He's got a hockey rink right here that he built, his own personal hockey rink, that's that. Um, he's got his own personal walkway down to the beach or to the dock. That's another thing he's got. The whole territory that he's on is, is right here, and he... And this aspect of it, which is a huge uh, portion of land, it belongs to the Russian government where he hijacked and so on and so forth. But that's not it. That's not the, uh, uh, all of it. Then you have, right, you have this whole squad that where they, how they siphon the money. That's one thing. Now let's take a look inside the place, right? So this guy has ultimately balls of steel. He came back to Russia. He's battling this massive corruption. Putin's supposed to be one of the richest guys in the world, but he stole his money by duping gullible Russian people. So he's got, um, well, a beautiful palace, essentially. It's very nice, uh, obviously. The, the problem is, is he was trying to keep it secret, and he got, uh, he got caught. And now, you know, all the blueprints are out. I mean, it's a big international thing of, of Putin's corruption. He's got his own arcade in there. He's got this. Holy the whole thing was uh, a billion dollars. Well, now the, well, this is his bedroom. Let's now the Russian the people know where their money is going. Now, exactly, exactly. So this is the, the, the bedroom, Putin's bedroom. You tell me what you think of this. First, it's the first living room, on the way to the bedroom here. I've never seen this before, by the way. Never seen this before. It's very interesting. <laughs> this is his bedroom. Could be better. It could, well, there's some little renders here that they, they, they do based on the schematics of the place. This is uh, one of the construction workers that was working on it. Another bedroom. Wow. That doesn't, fun doesn't stop there. He's got his own vineyard right here. All this. This and all that. Back there. He's got his specialized own. vineyard, specialized. You can't fly, it's a no-fly zone as this is that. So ultimately, Putin got caught in a massive corruption. This got 76 million views. This whole documentary, you can watch it with the subtitles. Um, I don't know what it's called, but you search for Putin Palace and you'll find it. I highly recommend you watch the whole thing. It shows you the whole trail of corruption. This guy who's narrating this has balls of steel. He was poisoned. <laughs> is poisoned by uh, by Putin nerve uh, with uh, uh, some nerve agent. He survived and he still came back to Russia. Released this documentary.
Putin can't really live at this billion dollar estate that he built now. And it's an interesting little drama whether Putin's going to kill him or try to kill him again. Putin's a killer, you know? He's got an amphitheater as well over there, all the documents this guy has. Mm, wow. All the connections of who's who and where they bribed and stole the money. It's a beautiful thing. He really made a masterpiece, and I really respect this guy. He's going to go into the ages as a true champion and nail this dude that tried to poison him. This is what you, this is the uh, uh, graphic you're looking at. So this is the story. What do you think of the story, Kush Papi? I think, uh, well, you know, I like history stuff myself. You know, everyone watching this probably just like, you know, they probably think I don't, but I actually do like this stuff. I think it's very interesting. I've never heard of this before today, so I'm probably gonna go watch it again later. Yeah. Right now, it doesn't make any sense. Doesn't make any sense. The thing is, is that there's vast corruption. This guy got caught, he was sloppy. He's a fool, he's a primitive guy in, in essence. Putin knows everything about lying, he knows everything about poison, he knows everything about killing, he knows everything about uh, uh, politics, and, but he knows nothing about money other than how to steal it and how to be uh, uh, corrupt. And that's the problem with a lot of Russia, right? Russia is a, a huge territory, like 12 time zones over there. It's got all these resources, but the Russian people could never get their shit together to take business seriously. They think that you get ahead in life by stealing for the most part. And that's a sad thing. That's why you had the, the problems that you had in Russia. Russia never had any good leadership, never had a chance maybe, you know, at certain, uh, at certain times in history they had some leaders, you know, Catherine the Great or what have you, but sadly, um, nowadays in recent history they haven't had much. They had ruthless bastards. Like yeah. Putin, who built himself a beautiful palace on the backs of the, the Russian serfs that are out there. Billion dollars, right? Yep, billion bucks. What could a Putin have done for the Russian people with that billion dollars instead of building himself a Playboy mansion? He could have taken care of all those Russian orphans that are out there, and there's all sorts of people struggling. The, the, the Russian people are, uh, the Russian economy's always been struggling. They're, they're, a, a Russian ruble is like a hundred rubles to a dollar. So, you know, their currency is completely ripped apart. He could have done a lot. Oh, this is one of my favorite parts of the interior here. He's got his own personal theater. This is the bar, right? But the, I love, he has, he's got his own stripper pole. So I was right. He turned it into a Playboy he man. He had a, yeah, he had a, uh, uh, he hit, this estate is huge and vast. And if you see the blueprint and all of the rooms, it's got its own spas, it's got its own casino, it's got its everything. The guy pulled off all the blueprints. So this is, one of my new heroes right here, a true champion. He got poisoned, he came to the country, he was arrested, and he dropped a video. This is something we, me and you do, and it got 76 <laughs> million views. So he's living in Russia right now? Or he's no? in prison right now. He's so getting, how did he release the documentary? He had it planned. He was, he was planned to be arrested. This is a, a person with balls here. Okay. This isn't um, X, Y, and Z, I'm not gonna I name just, them. <laughs> I'm not going to name them. This is a person that went out there, knew he was going to get arrested, and released the video while he was in jail, after he was being poisoned. He has no fear, and he's got 76 million views in three, four days, he, and, and he crushed it. Now Putin can never, he played him. He, he, Putin could never live in that mansion. All of his blueprints are out, all of his secrets are out, so he built a billion-dollar estate and got played. Uh, so now there's no point because he's not, it's he, not a secret anymore. Well, it's not a secret and it's like, yo, everybody, I mean, you could live there, but Putin, He's a target now. Putin, yeah, he's a target. Putin's got Parkinson's. It's supposed to be a secret estate. No one was supposed to knew there. The whole plan was to put this thing together and have nobody even come over, no airspace uh, restricted, no fly zone. Secret location. You can't uh, go, it was supposed to be absolutely secret. It was supposed to yeah. live there like a, like an emperor. Like retired. Like there. a czar. Yeah. yeah, he made it like a czar, but he's not a czar. It's supposed to be a, Russia's supposed to be a democracy, not a uh, monarchy. And he turned it into a monarchy and he killed his way to the top. And this guy has the balls to do something about it. And you know, that's why I like to take, I mean, I take a small stand. I don't want to battle these people and get poisoned and get killed. 
but I take I like to take a stand when I get a chance because this is got you got to keep the flames of democracy of what's right burning, and this is the guy right here that uh, that is a hero. He has a true spirit. And Why if, did he get poisoned, though? What did he do? Uh, he was <laughs> against Putin, you know what I'm saying? P Putin's a poisoner. Mm -hmm. Any final <laughs> words? Any final thoughts? I think it's a very interesting documentary. I think everybody should watch it. I think it's, you know, it's pretty cool. I'm going to watch it later um, when I'm chilling. But, uh, you know, thanks for having me on the Tracks News. Thank you. It's a good story. It's a good start and for everybody. Tune in. That's right, 100.